Hey, what's going on guys? Lethal Flux here. And I was at a uh, my local Fred Meyer in Portland, Oregon. And I found something that was kind of cool. And it is the Legendary Collection Game Board Edition. Um, I had never really seen one of these and I didn't think they made them for too long. And I thought it was really cool because it comes with all these Sly for Obelisk, Raw, and also on the back these are the packs you get right here. You get Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, Spell Ruler, Spell Ruler, uh, Pharaoh's Servant, Invasion of Chaos, and I don't remember what that middle one is. Uh, Pharaoh's Servant, Dark Crisis, that's what it is. Dark Crisis. You get the three god cards, and you get the vanillas, um, Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, Black Dragon, um, classics, the point of this is all to be all from the, the old stuff, so let's pop this bad boy open, it is sealed, Ooh. Ah, come on, open up, Okay, had to bust a hole in it first. Um, but yeah, I found the Fred Meyer, and I was like, "Whoa, sweet! What is that?" So I went over to go check it out. And at first, I thought it was just a normal legendary collection. I was like, "Whoa!" I didn't know they made it in box form. But then I found out that they uh, it was just this in box form, and it has like a mat and stuff. So the promos. Let's see what these guys look like. Got Obelisk, the Tormentor. The black's blue. Oh, they are nice. It's the colored backs, too. That's sweet. Obelisk, the Tormentor, my favorite. Sly for the Sky Dragon. And Wing Dragon Raw. So we got those three guys. And like I said, Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, and my favorite art of Red Eyes, Black Dragon. It looks so sweet. Nice. So let's put the gods. That's kind of cool that they come with the original blue, yellow, and red backs. I didn't know that. That's really cool, actually. And for our packs. Oh, let me show you guys the map first, actually. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. Actually, that looks really cool. Probably the best of all the cardboard mats. So this is the front of it, or back of it, rather. I don't know which one is. Oops. Which, but you got Slifer right there. Um, Red Eyes, my personal favorite, Demok. Come back, Demok. Come back to me. Um, you got a Raw right there. Got Exodia Necros. There's a Red Eyes Black Skull Dragon. Yeah, I wish I could show you guys. Oh, there you go. Red Eyes Black Skull Dragon. Obelisk right smack dab in the middle. And then you got Dark Magician on top. It's weird because my tripod is set up to where you can't really see the uh, all of it. So sorry about that. Not that any of you guys care, I don't think. But then you got uh, Pan. You got Kaiba. Starting from the left. Kaiba, Yugi. Oh, no, that's Joey. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Joey, Yu-Gi-Oh, and then Kaiba. The douchebag of Yu-Gi-Oh. Even though he's kind of cool. But yeah, that Slifer looks pretty badass. So yeah, let's bust into these packs. I'm going to see what we've got first. We've got Pharaoh Servant. Blue Eyes, White Dragon. Legend of Blue Eyes, White Dragon. Dark Crisis, Metal Raiders, Invasion of Chaos. Spell ruler. I'd really like an invasion of chaos demock. That would be amazing. So let's start with Dark Crisis. Let's start with Dark Crisis. Let's see what we get. Now remember, hollows are harder to pull out of the the like the old school packs because you either got a rare or you got a hollow. 
So getting a hollow back then was really um, was a big deal in, in most cases. That was the needles. I'm going to be naming these because you know, they're kind of older. Spell reproduction, Dark Scorpion, Gorg the Strong. Incandescent Ordeal, Dark Scorpion Combination, Sakuretsu Armor. I remember when everyone was playing that card. It was a good card back in the day. Cool. So our rare for that again was uh, Dark Scorpion Combination. Dark Scorpions were actually okay for for their time. Um, let's go next with Spell Ruler. Let's see what Spell Ruler will do. Sorry about this glare right here, but it's gonna happen. If we can pull a hollow, that'd be really nice. Toll, Firecracken, all these vanillas. I forgot about that. Gaia Power, Ancient One of the Deep Forest. <laughs> A rare nimble Mamanga, nice. Oh my god, you can pull... Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I did not know you could pull hollows, actually. I don't know if that's supposed to happen or if they just made that for Legendary Collection. But we just got an ultra rare Delinquent Duo. <laughs> that is awesome. I don't know if you guys know, but I have a band collection. That's going right in the band collection. Wow, that is really cool. And yes, this card is banned because it's broken as broken as all hell. But it looks really cool. Delinquent Duo. I wish they were first dead, but whatever. And a rare number one manga. That actually was not a bad pack. Put you, Mr. Delinquent Duo, right there. Let's go with uh, Metal Raiders next. A Jinzo out of Feral Servant would be really awesome. Let's see if we'll pull any hollows out of this. Here we go again with those those vanillas. So I guess we can pull hollows and a rare. I, I was not aware of that. I was pretty sure that you could only pull, you know, Skull Knight. Ancient Brain, Protector of the Throne. Shadow Ghoul, Destroyer Golem, Castle of Dark Illusions from the TV show. <laughs> High Sube and Deep Sea Shark. All these vanillas. Like, going through this, like, this is so... Like, a lot of you guys have probably never seen these cards, but I remember this card in the show was awesome. <laughs> Shadow Ghoul. But a lot of you have probably never seen, the, like, all these vanillas and stuff. But back then, like, a card like, you know, where is it? Oh, actually, maybe it's not in here. Yeah. But a card with 2,000 defense, like uh, Ancient Elf or whatever. Dude, that the card was actually good because it had 2,000 defense. And, uh, yeah. We're gonna save this bad boy for last, Legend Blue Eyes. So let's go with, uh, let's go with Pharaoh Servant next. Come on, something awesome. If we don't get something awesome, it's okay because opening is is just it's just really fun. All these old school packs. I wish the boxes weren't so gosh darn expensive. Otherwise, I'd do an opening for you guys. So we've got Driving Snow, Bombardment Beetle, Earth Shaker, Gradius, Monster Recovery, Dak. <laughs> What is that? Um, Do Doku Royabi? Doku, Doku Royabi? Royabi? I don't know. <laughs> Light of Intervention. Major Riot. And Insect Barrier. Our rare again was Monster Recovery. Mm, that Delinquent Duo, though. I'm actually really, really happy about that. We're going to go with Invasion of Chaos next. Let's try to add to that band collection, get a DMOC or something. But like I said, I think hollows are... I don't know if, like, what happened with that. I don't know if that was, like, a, a pack error or... I don't know. Skullmark Ladybug. Energy Drain. Curse Seal of Forbidden, Forbidden Spell. It's actually not a bad common. Sacred Crane. It's not a bad common either, actually. Enraged Battle Ox. That card wasn't bad back in the day either. Be Gone, Knave. Heart of the Underdog. Grand Maju da Daisy <laughs> and Primal Seed. That's actually Crystal of Forbidden Spell. It's not bad. And Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Will we get another Hollow? If not, it's okay because we got that Delinquent Duo. That's really cool. I'm happy about that a lot. Probably gonna see a lot of Vanillas and Spell cards from this. Oh yeah, Sogan. <laughs> 
Steel Ogre Grove. See something? Like this was really good because I had that 1800 fence. Legendary sword. And warrior number one. Dragoness, the Wicked Knight. Two Mouth Dark Ruler. Fire Yorio. Fire Yoro. Dark King of the Abyss and Beast Fangs. So no hollow in that pack, but that's okay. Look at all these vanillas though. Like <laughs> Like this is crazy. So many vanillas. Dragoness the Wicked Knight, though. Look at that. Look at that girl. So, the only hollow we pulled was Delinquent Duo. It was still kind of... It's still cool, though. Like, I feel like it was worth it. Like, I don't know. So, Delinquent Duo, and we got all these cool promos. So, oops, I'm the camera right there. Sorry about that, guys. So, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry I haven't uploaded again in a while. Um, thank you for... Thanks, subscribed, even though I haven't uploaded in a while. And, um... Yeah, just uh, really appreciate it. So, if you could slap that like button on your way out to viewing the next video that you will be viewing on YouTube today. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Like, rate, comment, subscribe, and peace out.